All right, so I know this topic has been covered extensively by a lot of people already, but I just keep getting more and more questions about it the closer we get to the beginning of the anniversary. So in today's video, I'm gonna quickly blast through all of the major dates that you guys will wanna mark into your calendars for this upcoming five-year anniversary on Global, and hopefully this is the last time I will ever have to address it. Okay, by the way, all these dates are directly from Team Tokener on Twitter, so I definitely think they're trustworthy, and all credit goes out to him. So without further ado, let's jump right into it, and yes, I am holding my phone in my hand because I want to make sure I get all the dates correct, so don't judge me. Okay, so starting on June 30th, we have the beginning of the official countdown to the anniversary. Like, I know it's been technically like a month worth of countdown already from the beginning of June, but this is the official one with the different countdown screens with the different Gokus and Vegetas and so on and so forth. And it will last for seven days up until July 7th. And then on July 7th, the five year anniversary will officially begin. And then two days after that on July 9th, and this is a big one, the dual Dokkan Fest between LR Vegito and LR Gogeta officially begins. This is when the banners drop, and this is when everybody can start summoning. So if you're planning to summon, which I think is like 99.9% .9 of the global player base, then good luck to you. I mean, there are a few people that have told me they plan to skip. I don't know if they're trolling or are they really just not big fans of Vegito and Gogeta? Like, I think it's hard to be a Dragon Ball fan and not like them, but if you're one of those rare people that is a Dragon Ball fan, but for some reason hates Vegito and Gogeta, then I guess you can skip, it's up to you, but I wouldn't recommend it. Anyways, <laughs> June, or sorry, July 9th is the official date that the banners will drop. And then, 10 days after, on July 19th, part 2 of the anniversary begins with some new events, and all that good stuff. And then about eight days after, on July 27th, we get the top legendary summon or double legendary summon banner featuring two new LRs, the uh, Int LR Rose, as well as the Fizz Broly, Chi Lai, and Lemo. And then finally, on July 29th, we will get the beginning of part three of the five year anniversary, which will come with a new stage for the Infinite Dragon Ball History event, as well as the Extreme Z area event for the SDR LR Goku Black, and allow us to perform the first ever LR Extreme Z Awakening in the history of Dokkan. And then on August 10th, the five year anniversary officially comes to an end, but not too long after that, at the end of August, the 350 million download celebration should start for both Global and JP. So if you thought that your wallet was safe after five year, you were wrong. Okay, so there you go guys, that is a condensed timeline for the upcoming five year anniversary on Global. Obviously there's a lot of other dates in there that I missed for certain events and stuff like that, but I wanted to keep this video fairly short, fairly concise, and hopefully this answered a lot of your questions. And if you're looking for a full breakdown of all the upcoming five-year events, I will be making a separate video for that, so definitely stay tuned. But for now, that's all I gotta say. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it, I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.